Hello everyone and welcome to the episode of Dodo 4 OCPFR and first episode we are going to be in this um in this New York City um, taxi for Victoria and um yes anyways we're going to be at 10 a and we're still going to call through things I sent to and uh yeah, two Latinas found Shimmy 1041 to name Ricardo. So, yeah, and also for those who don't know, this is an unmarked um, New York City um, taxi Crown Vic that will be um, using in this episode. And yeah, and there are just a couple of things I do want to say is that. What do you do in the comment section? Just please don't ask me to do, you know, GTA 5 uh, with a PDFR. Um, I will explain to that in just a moment, but when I respond to parts of a stolen vehicle over here, so. So, yeah, so. Whatever you do in the comment section, just um, you don't ask for me to do any more um, illness, PDFR, uh, alright, let's get out of the car right now. Turn around, hands on top of your head. Alright, so, I will explain why don't ask for any more GT5 as pretty far. Um, so, the reason why I said that is because whenever I, okay, so, whenever I, you know, start recording GT5 on a PDFR, um, you know, things happen to me, like, you know, like, I will either just get killed instantly during traffic stops, or I, or things just go chaos, and, and also, the reason why I'm no longer going to be doing LS PDFR is because of unrealistic, oh, sorry, you may do that. Is because of unrealistic emanation. Like whenever it's like whenever you get to fight with AI in GTA 5, it's like one or two punches, then they're like down on the ground. But in GTA 4, in GTA 4, um, it usually takes about like 10 punches. Depending on the um, AI's, you know, size and weight. So, and plus in GTA 5, like the cars in GTA 5 and the AI's in GTA 5, they feel like they don't have any weight at all. But in GTA 4, the cars have weight and the AI's have weight as well. So. You know, it's just I'm um, not gonna be doing any more um LS PDFR, so two nicking span shimmy call for and today for the same video called out. So uh if you do ask for you know GT five LS PDFR your comment will most likely just gonna be removed because you know, I'm not in dealing with AI same on GTA 5. Like, whenever I get into pursuit in GTA 5, half of times AI cops will just start shooting the suspect rapidly. And whenever I call for a paramedic in GTA 5, it's like they just, you know, leave the body there, the patient is dead. So. But, but the um, but the per, but the uh, paramedics, and um, in GTA 4, like, like um, 
So take oh my bad. This is going that one. Look at this. In in GTA 5, like whenever they hear gunshots or things going on area, like the AIs, they will just be you know crouching and like freaking out all the time. But but in GTA 4. Whenever the AIs hear their gunshots or they hear something going on in the area, they just run for their lives on like GTA 5. Because in GTA 5, they just pretty much just stand there and just crash there like all the time. So, and what I was going to say before is um, that in GTA 4, whenever you call for an ambulance on an AI um, even though if the patient might be dead the paramedics in GTA 4 will put them in a buy bag of their own I believe so yeah I mean like unlike you know, GTA 5 paramedics where they just take out notes for bodies it's just doesn't feel realistic to me so that's why I just never stick with GTA 4. But GTA 4 has a lot more cool stuff than Permit 5 does, so. I'm pressing GTA 5 whenever there's like a random AI pursuit. You mostly would just hear, you know, cops do it all the time. Like, come on, seriously. So. That's why I'm sticking with GTA 4. In GTA 4, the cops and the permit seems to be a lot more common. Doing, you know, like the cops in GTA 4 seem to be a lot more common and pursue, so like they just don't, you know, start rapid shooting a suspect. The only time you see cops in GTA 4 will shoot the suspect during a pursuit if it's like they're. If the suspect is putting people lives in danger, but as soon as the pursuit starts in GTA 5, the AI cops will just start shooting the suspect instantly, which it kind of drives me nuts. So that's why I'm sticking with you know, GTA 4. So and again, if you do ask for new GTA 5, I would ask PDFR. Just, just don't, okay? Because you know, this is going to be your final warning, and if you do ask for it, then your comment will most likely going to be ignored, and and it's pretty much it, so. Available units respond to a criminal resisting arrest in Mohanet Avenue. Um, okay then, I got these two guys who are sitting there. <laughs> so it says you're not busy with receive call outs and you're only really busy with we'll receive call outs, okay. Okay, dude. Almost coming off right there. All right, I see. I see. Yeah. There's no one coming by. Uh, this patrol might be short 
So yeah, and well, I'm missing Red Knight, but it's screen for AI since the tough guys are a bit bugged over here. So I'm not going to the tough guy in this area. The tough guy around this area are like kind of bugged out, so I'm not going to worry about the AIs whether Red Knights or not. So. This one here is also bugged, so... Don't block the... Don't block the box. Fine, plus two points. Okay, then. I need a unit for a drug deal in, uh, Meadows Park. Two lithium spiders spawning, um... Code to the person for majority of progress in the park. Two of the team spots should be on scene. Two of the team spots just fire, shots fire. Do so you guys can go in. Alright people, watch out. Alright, shots fire, shots fire. Get down, get down, get down, get down. Two lithium splash, two suspects are down. Um, Judge um, calls me a uh, call for. Man, even that guy Zebra is smart. He just uh, got his car there and just ran off to save his own life. I know in GTA 5, either two things the answer to in GTA 5 they hear shots. One, they just keep on settling, running over, it's just annoying. Or two, they would just bump into a wall and just, just kill himself. But in GTA 4, you guys saw right there, you know, he heard shots and he saw shots and he decided, you know what, you know, heck this, I'm right out of here, see my own life, don't care about my car anymore. So, the AI is actually pretty smart. Like, you know, I'm gonna give the, you know, the GTA 4 AI, you know, good credit and the GTA 5 AI is bad credit, so. But anyways, two late teams pass, should be a call for intending off of that shots fire call right there. It's a very nice uh, war fountain. Look at that, a nice little scratch on my. Ooh, got some bullet holes. Ah, that's not good. <laughs> that is not good whatsoever. Nice uh, contending, but I'm not gonna worry about that. Two Nicktean Spash should be responding code 3 per suspect. 
This is near West uh, Beach Road City. Alright, so right now we're gonna try and get over there, so... Get over there, so this is control suspect last seen at a uh, gray Dundreary Admiral on Broke of Dukes Expressway. Alright, so it's gonna be that on Broke of Dukes Expressway. So, and of course, he escaped. Alright, no big deal. I um, mean, you know, just keep it the escape, it's not the end of the world, so, you know. But I'm going to go ahead and park in here. To the team's pass, show me a uh, call for from that uh, suspect resisting arrest call. Suspect escape before me to the crime scene. Um, so. Yeah, so, um, anyways, um, that'd be the first episode, um, I'm sorry if it was, like, kind of shorter than others, um, so, you know, um, so, reason why it was, um, short, um, I just wanna say that I'm just, you know, just a little tired right now to, like I do have the energy to record but not record a long episode like I usually do so this is going to be a short one since I just didn't really have the enough energy just to record so um so if you guys did enjoy please preach the like comment and subscribe and I'll see you next time bye